for something a little bit more genteel. Elite Dangerous. What a game. What a game. <laughs> do is I am going to advertise the fact that I am streaming on Reddit because that, believe it or not, always seems to get me some good views. So. Let's do that. Sorry, I'm just getting the link together for my uh, stream here. I always seem to get good response from uh, from Reddit. All right. Let's see if we can't rank up. strike contracts. Career jobs? Sure. I'll take that. Fourteen light years away. Nothing. Strip chicken out. Not even worth somebody's time interdicting me. Which would be nice not to be interdicted, but I'm fine.
damage the ship. Cantor, was that not the name of the prison planet in the Superman mythos? I don't remember. Nice and easy. Nice and gentle. Well, no people want to rush in, that's fine. Tour installation sounds like a club made at 18 to 30s. <laughs> club. <laughs>
know about all that. I'm gonna go home. See what's going on in my home system. Now I can uh, go from there. Might have some slightly more friendly missions for me there. to kill, I want the play to create and progress. Travel universe in peace. Free, just send some messages and we'll uh, have a little discussion. Whoa! Get the FSD cooldown. The important thing to remember is that while I'm fitted with a uh, Think they're absolutely useless to me because I don't know how to use them. Sharp maneuver in the sun there. Oh. Next stop, Alpha Centauri.
Dr. Samuel Beckett always hoped that the next jump would be the jump home. Don't forget, this liner's in the top 1% of all liners out there. My home base is currently Boston base. Until I can get myself up to the rank to get a Seoul permit. And then once I get that and get into Seoul, I'm planning on either Mars or possibly um, around Earth. Maybe Abraham Lincoln. Who knows? Or can you make the planets your base? Because maybe I'll, be, I'll make a base on earth, who knows? Who knows? The universe is my oyster. I guess. My big black milky oyster. Delicious. Boston base, Bernard Star, It would have been my home base whenever I would have played on the Amiga as well, so it's going to remain my home base. Three commanders on their way. That is absolutely teeming by Marine outside, and my head just started pounding there. So at least I'm playing this and it's relaxing. Look at that, that's beautiful. Stomach.
Viper Mark Three in there. Got my Eagle. And my Otter. Sell some Universal Cartographics. Head off all right, actually.
I don't see why you would need a better fuel scoop. I just don't see why you would need one. thing I could maybe replace would be the power plant. Yeah, a better power plant. take a mission and just follow it and see what happens and maybe I'll come across a job where I don't have to murder anybody and that'll be great. Shooting the place, huh? Yeah, there's some more shooting places. Get them sometimes. Salon and they here I come. Here I come. My bath.
Vehicle scoop disengaged. Parry Dapo, it's a hole. say that because you think I might dislike it for the name for obvious reasons. Which in fairness is correct. That does turn me off. The fact that it has that name. But, you know, what can you do? Mission's what it is. Look at the pay at the be concerned about things like that. Lee. The planet is called Lee. What's next? The moon called Kevin? I gotta read about Lee when it wants to land. It looks absolutely thrilling. It's some kind of water planet? Actually, <laughs> might be good actually. Could you imagine a water planet for a holiday? That'd be cool. Looks fairly earth like. The lead looks a fairly happening place, actually. I may be convinced to attempt a orbital landing just for the gag of it. Super relaxed. I love this game. Scan detected. We would like to remind all commanders to avoid access to access during arrival and departure. Avoid 
blinding on me, but I'm on the lights. I don't want to go down that much, or oh, about the power, you yeah. know. Need the credits more. Naval supply mission. Excellent. Jobs are the best I can do at the moment, I think. Might be able to flog some universal cartographics. And there's the rain started again. Oh, hey, I can flog them actually. Nice one. A couple of thousand. Now to take a oh Scottish this boy Scottish hello for the safety of other vessels please don't be uh, blocking the exit well I'll no be blocking them don't worry it's all right Wally I'll no block them I'm not Scottish by the way I'm Northern Irish. Uh, Nothing but crap jobs here. I'm taking off. I'm going down to that planet. Let's try a planetary landing. For a giggle. Take my last sip of iced tea. Have to get some more in a minute. Oh, she's a bolting lass. You wears clear for departure. Oh, wacky thump. My ship, it's called the Melita, which is a ancient name for Malta. Um, which is a very precious place to me. Uh, I, I am in a queue, as you can see. There's still traffic in the 23rd century. Quite a bit of traffic actually in this place. Uh, I, I managed to get up to the Cobra Mark III quite quickly. I was hoping to spend a bit more time with my adder, but, you know, what can you do? Alright, we'll be buying time soon. In the interest of the smooth traffic flow, then I block the access to the docking pads now. We don't want the, the docking pads to be blocked. Please now, come on. Come on, lads, don't fight. Don't fight about it. No, sir, there's no need to say that about me. No, no, I don't appreciate you making those comments about my mother. You know, that's the height of that, really. Beautiful. Look at that. Stunning. This game should be hung in the Louvre. Quick weather report. Outside is absolutely teeming down, so I am doing the right thing by having a day off work and playing Elite Dangerous. Now let's get down to business. Scan 
Oh yeah, I wanted to land on the planet, didn't I? Where am I headed? Um, nowhere in particular. I'm just sort of, you know, chilling, seeing the sights. Oh no, there's no city on that planet. There's no city only. I'll do a, I'll do a, a planetary landing here in Mitterrand Hollow. What do you think? Mitterrand. Is that after Francois Mitterrand? Is it? Oh, it's on the... Oh god, no, not going there. It's a prison. Um, did I just see Whitney Houston? Did that actually say Whitney Houston? Schneider Relay, oh, London Relay. Allison World. I'll go to Allison World because my wife's name is Allison, and uh, that'd be a nice wee thing. Ross Colony, Riley Settlement, Cry Love Installation, Lenton Reach. I think we'll go to Ross Colony. I was hoping to go to the planet Lee, but there's nothing really there, apparently. So let's go to Ross Colony on Allison World. Get my frameshift drive going. Two, one, engage. of course have to be all the way on the other side of the system but hey let's go cool. I wonder will there be Scottish there I'm really hoping to get a nice naval contract so I can up my rank because um, I'm working to get a SOL permit. Um, so that is my aim at the moment. That's what I'm playing towards. So let's see what happens. But I'm just sort of meandering about it. I'm not doing it as a main targeted goal. It's just the thing that I'm doing, you know. Excuse me. Yeah, the super crisis assist. Yeah, nah, I don't care about it. See us. <laughs> cool. Well, if you bump into me at all, feel free to add me and um, do some voice chat because I'm sort of quite eager to try doing the voice chat on the game. Uh, I would quite like to tr see how that works to see if it's really like sort of like Star Warsy type thing, you know, where they're flying about and they can contact each other be quite nice. See us? Hmm. I think it's see. Oh boy, you're way, 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 way out. Crikey. Just gonna gonna say hey, I'll swing by, but no chance. <laughs> I'm afraid that's well out of my jump range. Which is a pity. Now I'll do we planetary land in here in the city and then maybe take off and land on the planet surface and show you what the wee buggy looks like because it's quite cool. Because I don't think there's very many videos out there with the buggy. Or SRV, as it's called. Okay, coming up on orbit fairly soon. There's a 
everybody else head the same way. So I'm landing on Allison World. My wife's name is Allison, so this will be a nice V uh, tie in there. Heading to Ross Colony on Allison World. So how are you finding see us? I uh it's not somewhere I've been. It would be somewhere I'd be interested in going to see. So that's what, sort of what I'm doing, I'm just traveling the galaxy seeing sights. Obviously Allison World is high on my priority list. Landing on the dark side of Allison World too. Brilliant. Would only be me. And on the side farthest from the sun. Well, here we go, nothing ventured, nothing gained there. Orbital flight engaged. Make sure the fun begins. Can't imagine see us would be a holiday destination to be fair. No offense. <laughs> so when I were the kids, the Butlins is fantastic. Well, I can go to the bingo and I can go to the pub. Dropping in the glide. Keep getting these puffs from the air fresher my wife bought. That's bizarre. Smooth. Access <laughs> granted. Adjust heading for approach to pad zero four. You are clear for alternated approach, Commander. For a city landing at night.
probably can't sell anything more here than I could on the space base now. Can't. Let's see if they've got any different missions though. We're all the Russians here. Hello, we're Russian. We like the Russian things that are quite Russian. Hmm. My wife said I'm Russian. I said, <laughs> no, I'm just in a hurry. <laughs> and see what good to take. It's quite a nice place. Right, let's see. Absalom panel. Oh god. Eight Plus eight, what's that? Sixteen, twenty. I could do that. I could do that mission. Yeah, we'll do that. So, Better. Oh, that job's gone. rank for that one. I'll just do this mission in the meantime and then hopefully I can get my mission level up. Hang on, what is my rank on? Trade rank peddler. Alright, so what I'll do is this. some shit and take it with me. If I can make a profit on any of it then I'm quids in. Oh we got bio waste. Brilliant. Seven tons of bio waste. There we go. Everybody's happy. Everybody's happy. from Bolton he sounds a bit like Alan Bennett. He's looking for cooperation. Oh yeah, hang on. Didn't I say I was gonna fly about and maybe land somewhere?
lot of on the dark side of a planet, though. You know, the SRV can wait. Shout out to Captain Twelfthy, by the way. I know he's not playing at the moment, but he's my my homie. from this close to a planet. Eee, scary. Wanna do it anyway. Got away with it. Nice one. Let's see what accent these now next guys have. What do you think, Nullhead? Who do you think they would be? that sun there. But sad nothing like him, but sad him all like Mick Jagger. Yeah, Mick Jagger. Mission critical message. Yeah, Mick is a mission critical message. Yeah, Mick, have you seen the price of these potatoes? a reference to there used to be a, a show called Stella Street and it was like um, John Sessions and a couple of other comedians and they used to just do impersonations of all these celebrities that were supposed to live on the same street like Mario Kane who uh, was not a nosy neighbour he just liked to uh, walk about a bit of main character you know very very good very good show missed a lot Oh, we're going to Tavis Terminal. Okay. No entiendo. No entiendo español. Sorry, I was doing a very bad impersonation of Michael Keane. Now an interesting thing is, uh, I suffer from a neurological condition uh, called cluster headache and also with uh, my face, culture general neuralgia and they're both very painful and this game really helps chill me out and sort of helps me with the, the pain management of, of the conditions but also um, like the depression and anxiety that comes with it, so I think it's it's quite good. You know, as a game, it just sort of chills me out, which I like. But sometimes, unfortunately, I'm quite un difficult to understand. So, if you do need to ask me anything, feel free. Plus, my accent. Now, let's get the Tavis terminal. Without further ado.
Cobra Mark III is not a bad wee ship. Seems to be doing alright for me. It's funny thinking that was the first one on the Spectrum version on my dad's ZX Spectrum that I would have played. Hey Mick, how much does the Mick Jagger Covis cost? You see the price of these marshmallows? Etc, etc. Hey Keith, how much? Myself in a nice safe area and dark. Thank you very much. Like a glove. You can tell I have practiced that. So I'm currently at recruit rank and I want to get a higher rank so I can get into Saul. So I need a nice, simple courier job for the Federal Navy that I can uh, complete and get my next rank. Quid pro quo, Gladys. Welcome to Tevis Terminal. Let's see what's going on here. Not a lot. The knights must fly by. I don't want to strike contract. They're all murders, and I don't do murders. I don't do murders, I'm afraid. Does look a wee bit like me, I suppose. Not 100%, obviously, but you know, that's a bit like me. There's my ship. Not a bad bit of kit, if I do say so myself. Got her painted nice and eighty style. Now right, let's see if there's any better missions now. Oh, now we're talking Federal Navy. Cur ah, for. Unless, unless, he said, no, that would make a loss. an adventure <laughs> a 
Are you English? I'm sorry, I hope I'm not uh, hardly offending you with my accents or attempts at them. Jagger. Oh, you're American, right? Whereabouts? I'm in Northern Ireland. I. <laughs> Sorry. Texas, okay. Apologies, daughter. <laughs> well now, you're from Texas, huh? Well, I can't do a Texas accent, but I can do a pretty good, um, I don't know where that would be from, where you could say this is from. Maybe Boston? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. That's probably the worst American accent I've ever done. Sorry about that. It's not too bad, I suppose. I could pass if I was over here. Maybe not over in the States, but if I was here, people would think that I'm from uh, somewhere, you know, Boston, Beantown. But I, I suppose I could pass, I guess. I don't know. I just like doing accents. No, let's see. Where are we headed? So how did you first play Elite? Did you play it back in the days of the old microcomputers, or is this your first Elite game? Because the first Elite I played was on the BBC Micro back in the early 1980s, which was the original one, made by Ian Bell and David Braben, the two geniuses that they are. And then I had Elite Plus on the Amiga 1200. Um, Frontier Elite 2, which was the best game of all time ever. Hands down, nothing else. A free joystick? Man, that's a good friend. That's the kind of friend you gotta look after. Gagnon Terminal? Mmm, Wapum Gagnon style! Mmm, mmm, mmm. Wapum Gagnon style! That's a terrible pun. Sorry about that. Was it one of the Hutas joysticks? The ones that have like the thingy jig? You know, with the what's a doodah? I just use my simple PlayStation pad and my nice cheap um, but perfect for my TN uh, Turtle Beach headset. Are you, oh, do you play on PC or do you play on PlayStation? Ah, okay, I'm playing on uh, PS Pro, PS4 Pro. Which is the one that upscales everything to 4K and all. But this is playing natively in 4K on my 4K TV. I'm on a 55-inch 4K TV at the moment, which is nice. Otherwise, I wouldn't be able to see shit. Can't see shit, sir. Oh, he doesn't know if he can go through with the welling. Oh, that's going to be good.
Ah, cool. So you're a fellow neurological disaster like myself then? Oh, ceremony starting soon. This could be a bit of a, a wedding drama. What a beautiful wedding, said the bridesmaid to the waiter. But what a shame, what a shame the poor groom's bride is a whore. I just chimed in with... Why don't you people just close the goddamn door? That's not the words of the song, sorry, I forgot them. But yeah, I'm a neurological nightmare. So I know your pain. So this um this Turtle Beach headset has the memory foam on the things on the earpieces, so it's nice and cozy for me and it doesn't hurt me, which is good. Either way, there's a wedding barge out there with a man going, mm, I don't know if I want to get married. He doesn't. So what time is it in Texas that mm, you guys be about five hours behind us? It's quarter past ten in the morning here. It's a lot later there. Oh, today's the best day of his life. Oh, it's quarter past five in the evening. Cool. Or in the morning. Five eight. Oh, okay. You don't sleep either. Cool. I understand. Mm, let's keep the wedding barge up there. That looks exciting. That's a little uh, bonus story for the ladies there. They love a good wedding. I love a good wedding! Alright, all right, Sybil, settle down. I'll have to get some more iced tea soon. Shoot, coming in too hot. Or am I? No, I should be alright. There we go. I'm okay. Did come in a bit hot though. Enjoy this poor guy's uh, wedding nuptials. Mm, something's creaking a bit in the ship. Doesn't sound good. Doesn't it sound good? Marcel. Cobra Mark III. 
That's not much, but it does the job, you know. Gets me from A to B. That gets me a uh, rank upgrade as well. Why am I still a recruit? Oh no, I did a, I did a, um, I had a uh, adder before this. I've also bought a eagle. And I think it's a not a crate. It's another. It's an attack vessel anyway. But pretty cool ships. Just getting a little fleet together. I'm collecting them all, like Pokemon. Gotta catch them all. Oh, permanent acquisition. Von Manon's star. Do I really care about Von Manon's star? Python. Ah, the hell that'll go. I can always turn it down once I figure out what it is. Oh, I'm not even high enough to get it anyway. Meh. I don't care about Von Manon's star anyway. Thanks, mate. I don't really care, mate. I don't really care. Once more into the fray. Here we go. So, um, you're awake at 5 a.m. I'm taking it that the uh, sleep is not happening for you. So, what's uh, what's on your mind? Is it the migraines? Whoa, sugar lumps! And that's, my friends, why you don't cut out of the uh, auto auto launch sequences. They're there for a reason. It's cool. What do you work as? I do admin work. Highly exciting. That's why I like the plan of a pilot. Oh, okay, cool. Like band t shirts or just like a little print place? <laughs> I'm sure. Oh, here we go. Oh cool, so you would you would print for like rock bands and stuff like that then? By the way, everybody, if you want to, uh, please like and subscribe, or uh, I've got a Patreon. Graphic uh, Patrick down there. If uh, if you want to shoot me a couple of pound, if anybody's out there. But oh, cool! So any bands I would have heard of, if you print off any Greta Van Fleet t-shirts, find my way. These guys are going to be big. Drive 
Texas is a crazy big place too. Man. Somewhere I'd love to see. First thought most people have when they think of Texas is cowboys and stuff like that, though. Well, it's totally not like that nowadays, obviously. It would be a big city. Uh, well, wherever you are in Texas, it's obviously a state. It's made up of thousands and hundreds of cities. It's probably like a small country, especially compared to where I am. I'm in a city called Lisburn, which is just outside Belfast City in Northern Ireland. Which is a separate country to the Republic of Ireland, just so we're all clear on that. Why am I heading back through my home system? It's weird. Steers and queers, huh? Well, to be honest, where I'm from is mostly country outside the city where I live. It's a very rural country, Northern Ireland. A lot of farming. Cows, or coos as they're called here. Uh, the all that sort of shit. It's highly exciting. I would say that it's a beautiful country, it's not bad. Better when we're not fighting. The coos. Hey, hey, the shuck. There's a Northern Irish farming word for you. A shuck. Shuck is a. Uh, Bitch. Spell S H E U G H. Shuck. I got stuck with Shuck. Tractor. Got the tractor stuck with Shuck. We're going to Brugley Terminal. Here's cat girl. Saying hello. Mm -hmm. right, put your foot down, put your foot into it. your thing. Now push your foot down into it. You haven't got them on the wrong feet. You've got them on the right feet for once. Right, sorry about that. <laughs> Normal services resumed. 
That's why I'm a member of the group The Fatherhood on uh, it's internet. They're a group of elite players who play whenever the kids go to bed. Oh, this would be a nice approach. That was a nice approach. That was nice and relaxing. Chill. Yeah, the Fatherhood's quite a good group actually, because it means that you know, there's other people that are like you that get to play the games at certain times of the day whenever the kids aren't there. That's cool. Check out my uh, the news later. I tell them this is. I mean, this is the perfect game for that because you can play just one or two missions in an evening. It's chill. You know, you're not. You don't have to get into the combat. You can just go and do what I'm doing here and just be a courier. You know, you could just chill out in the evenings. It'd be nice, relaxing. Switch off game, you know, it switches the mind off. It is kind of a time suck, though, that's the thing, that's true. But it's a worthwhile time suck, I think. This man is your friend? <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't resist. sucks well you know that could be the good a good game for him then as I say because I mean it would be a good thing to help him switch off in my opinion the old brain off and go nothing more relaxing than into the blue Danube you know seen it on the PC and being so jealous and then hearing that it was coming out to the, the PlayStation I was like yes thank god oh they're all very English here got a decent rap.
Yeah, if you just want to be an, you know, uh, <laughs> an asshole on people. <laughs> Although I, I like, I like the Nate. I did. Just I'm not very into the combat side of things. I'm more flight, you know. Clear the explosion zone. You're clear. I'm all oh, peace and love, bro. I'm Star Trek Next Generation. It's all hippy dippy bullshit. Oh, that's true. PvP sucks. I hate PV people who PvP. Although, it's not something that it's good that it's an option, and I think it should be something that is there because it, it heightens the realism. I mean, in the real world, you're going to have people that will PvP, so it's better to have that there, I think, than not there. I mean, open, open world is my favourite mode. Just the thought that there's a real living, breathing, artificial universe there. It's crazy. Incoming mission critical message. Incoming mission critical message. Sounds like C3PO. Or no, he sounds more like, is it Vision in Avengers? Sounds like him. I just like being able to escape the real, real world, you know? Because it's bad enough. And to be able to get away from it. That's nice. Especially whenever you're able to get away from it in the world where you don't have to fight, you know? You, you can just pay your way and get around. Oh, Merlin! Ah, oh, man, I remember this place! I used to come here on the Amiga. I used to come here on the Amiga because I remember Merlin. That was a great place. Man, I haven't been in this system in a long time. this done I suppose I'd better go because I've got to make the kids their lunch and uh, make myself something to eat I haven't really had anything to eat today but I'll probably be back on fairly shortly mm, it's all right for putting those really good motors on. Boosters and that was actually quite a decent landing. Or lip machine, yeah. Oh, I pulled it back. I pulled it back. It was okay. It wasn't too bad. Started to get away from me. Oh man, 
look at that. Look at that. Oh, such a game. Look at that. Look at the level of detail. It's just amazing. Look at the etches on all the paneling and all. Oh, man. Brooklyn City. Let's be a minor red dwarf. Oh, they're all American here. He ain't allowing no intolerable behavior. No intolerable behavior, so. Navy strike contracts. Be coming in at a loss. I was say, I'm sure my whole integrity took a bit of a bad turn. Uh, please do remember to like and subscribe and uh, also hit me up on Patreon. Thank you and uh, I hope to see us again. Bye.